Good morning, everyone. It is uh, Saturday, December 31st. Happy New Year. Well, tonight. And uh, what I'm going to do this morning is um, check the rear battery voltages individually in all the cells. And uh, it is a little bit of a job, but I just wanted to show you how easy it is. Um, I have a the DC to DC and the uh, charger on a shelf on top of the battery box. So I simply unplug the charger and I'm going to remove the, well, I'm going to unscrew the bolts that attach this to the battery box. So you get to watch me. There's a screwdriver, and I'll speed this up in the video so you get to see what's going on. So I'm just going to remove all the screws first, and then I'll come back. Okay, I'm back. So all the bolts around the legs on top and the shelf are off, and now what we're going to do is disconnect the Anderson connectors. Anderson connectors are disconnected. This shelf is easily removed. The Lexon top has a hole in it, so we can just get those connections through it and remove the Lexon top. That's how easily it is to remove that. And now what we're going to do is take our voltmeter and our multimeter and check each cell individually and see what voltage we have. And I'll read them off to you. 3.37 Three Three point three nine, three point three seven, three seven, three seven, three eight, three seven, three six, three six. Three six, three five, three six, three point three seven, three point three nine, three point three six, three point three nine. 3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 3.3 
I guess, within a, a, a good range. Uh, what I'm going to do now is take my uh, half inch socket and see if any of the connections have loosened up. Um, seem to be tight so the vibration hasn't released these. I will eventually replace these split washers with Nord locks. So that's how quick it took to check the voltage uh, of each individual cell. Uh, I think I will do that periodically, maybe every two months, depending on how many miles I do. And uh, that's it. As boring as that was, that's what has to be done. That's the maintenance on these things. So, uh, I'll be talking to you.